mummies. Subject of today's film is uh, some mummy figures I had on hand. This is a custom. This is a custom. He's older actually than this one. I just finished this Karloff. This is the old uh, Lon Chaney Jr. Karas mummy uh, from the 40s films. He was all tattered and ragged and pieces hanging everywhere. Really a messy, messy looking mummy. And the Karloff original one was a very smooth, uh, slim line guy when they found him in his casket and, uh, and woke him up. And then he later uh, is this character. It's the same guy. These two are the same guy. It's just different. This is first of the movie. This is later. And uh, M. Hotep then gets the this, this scroll of Thoth trying to bring his beloved back to life and all that stuff. But when they first find him, first like five or ten minutes of the movie, it's the only time we see Karloff in this actual wrapping. And um, I spent a lot of time trying to find a really nice slimline body that had a realistic torso and, and scale to the head so that it looked like Karloff's build and not just you know when you when you wrap this tightly it, it, it has to look a little more like the guy to begin with um, this was a bigger guy so again it didn't really matter he had so many rags hanging on him but this guy he's got to be a pretty svelte thin you know almost not so much bony but but definitely closer to the person's anatomy this was what it was it was like a sideshow buck and this was this undersuit was on there. Imagine the wrappings over this undersuit. And you start getting that. You see the legs don't really look very Karloff-like. And so this is a much more, if you can see that, uh, the build. I've got this, I've got a focal problem here with this thing. But you can you can see that's the, the Karloff mummy. It's brand new. Just being shown for the first time. Got the red just opened his eyes for the first time in 4,000 years look. And uh, and that's the Figure Master Less Mummy Collection. Hope to have a Frankenstein and a Dracula movie soon. So uh, stay tuned.